Hey everybody, it's that time again, time for Daryl's Monday Market Report. Well, it's a crazy, crazy market out there. I was out with the buyer this weekend looking at the home on acreage. There were probably a hundred people there looking at homes on acreage. So buyers just know it's crazy. And I've mentioned this before, but if you're a buyer and you're looking at new construction, make sure that you have a realtor on your side and a good lender. You're, you're going to need it out there right now. It's, uh, it's super crazy. If you're a seller, it's a great market. And let's talk about that this week. In the Collin County area, have 913 properties either new to the market or that have sold. That's up 51 from last week. Numbers are rising, which is good, but still not, not enough properties to replace what's selling and going under contract. So in Collin County this week, 296 properties new to the market or had a price change, 281 under contract. So that's only 16, like 16 new properties when you, when you look at that. 104 went pending, 213 sold. And, and again, sellers across all price points. Again, we're starting to see multiple offers. Been talking with folks, even in the million dollar price range, 200, 300, 400, 500 thousand dollars. Talking to someone today, he told me about a situation where someone offered 200K over and somebody offered 300K over their 200K, so 500K over. So it, it's nuts out there. In Allen this week, 30 new properties hit the market or had a price change, 21 went under contract, 11 went pending and 19 sold. Lucas, only one new property to the market this week. Again, it's a small city, but look at this, six went under contract. So if you put something on the market this week, it's going to go fast. Nothing went pending and three sold. Fairview, another smaller market, six new properties hit the market or had a price change. Four went under contract, one went pending, and nine sold. Parker had one new property to the market this week, three went under contract, nothing went pending, but one sold. Again, smaller city, but higher price range, and that's where the property was. I looked at where there were probably 100 people looking at a home on acreage. So if you're looking at homes on acreage, even in the $600,000 or more, lots of people looking us all plates from uh, California, Jersey, Georgia, Illinois. So a lot of Texas plates, it's just nuts. Be, be prepared if you're out there shopping for a home and sellers, be prepared because you're going to get more <laughs> offers than you could imagine most likely. This week in Plano, 62 new properties hit the market or had a price change, 66 under contract. So that's like negative inventory ad this week in Plano. Pretty much, pretty much the same across every city in Collin County. So it's just great to be a seller. 19 went pending and 42 sold. McKinney, we had 71 new properties hit the market or had a price change this week. 52 went under contract. 28 went pending and 57 sold. Frisco, we had 63 new properties hit the market. 61 went under contract. 21 went pending and 40 that sold. Melissa, eight new properties hit the market this week or had a price change. Five under contract. Five went pending and six sold. Princeton, 11 new to the market this week. 19 under contract. So again, negative inventory filled there by eight. Nine went pending and nine sold. Wiley, 17 new to the market this week. Nine went pending, or nine went under contract. Eight went pending and 11 sold. Up in Anna, one of our outlying areas, we had three new properties hit the market or had a price change. Four went under contract. Four went, went pending and five sold. Levon, three new properties hit the market or had a price change. Four went under contract, nothing pending this week, one that sold. Farmersville, four new to the market, one went under contract, nothing pending, and one sold. 
And I, I've been talking about a property that was coming to the market soon this week, probably midweek. Going to have one coming in Wiley in the 290 areas with the pool. So if you're looking in that area, or if you're an agent wondering if there's new uh, new inventory coming, there's one coming this week. Hope you're having a great day. If you have any questions, if you have any subject you want me to cover, I've been super busy working till 7, 8 o'clock every night. Took yesterday off. But feel free to reach out to me. My contact information is at the end of this video. Have a great one. Have a great week. Enjoy the weather. Talk to you soon.